how nice has it been being a kid from E-Town to have your, your family, your friends so close so they can come up and see you know, just about every home game? Uh, it's been pretty awesome. Um, it, it's been kind of cool to see the support of, of the people back home and, and my mom getting the opportunity to come see me play quite a bit. So um, that's been a pretty cool experience. Um, I know a lot of people really didn't think I would ever really make it this far or be right here today. See you later. It's cool to see that people really show the support and, and take notice of the things that I've been I've been doing over my career. Being a guy from Indiana, you know your family's pretty close, you know, within a four-hour drive from Rooseville. Uh, talk about having them, you know, within a driving distance and being able to see you play and develop. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, that's one of the main reasons I picked Kentucky. It was you know four hours from home, uh, closest SEC school to home. My parents come down every weekend. You know they're they're able to support me. They're able to drive down and uh, you know watch me play even on the road. You know a lot of trips aren't that aren't that far, and you know they've made it a point to especially this last year or two to to make it to every series. And you know I've been so so fortunate, so lucky to uh, to have them be able to you know share this experience with me. When you think back on your four years, is there is there one play, one moment that kind of stood out to you as hey you know I belong in the SEC, I belong at this level, competing against the best. Yeah, my, well, my freshman year, I, I, uh, I went through a long time where I struggled, and, you know, I'm still getting thrown out there, and I'm struggling, I'm struggling. I, I'm just trying to chip away and, you know, find a way to, to really, you know, help the team. And uh, I think the moment for me was when I, I was down at LSU. It was a Thursday night game, and uh, it was an ESPN game of the week. And uh, a, a kid hit a ball up the middle, and I made a really nice play in the middle. Ray Frimes up the middle, nice play by the second baseman. I tell you what, that's as good as it gets from Matt Rada. And I think everybody in the LSU Stadium kind of like, kind of applauded for me a little bit. And it was kind of that moment I was like, okay, wow, you know, I can do this. I belong here. And, uh, you know, it, it just kind of went on from there. Are there a couple moments that just kind of stand out to you as uh, kind of knowing that you belong in the SEC and you belong competing at this level? Um, I would probably have to say this year. Um, I know last year I, I caught quite a few games, but, you know, you still have that kind of uncertainty and that doubt of whether or not you really should be here. Um, with not really having too much success. And I know early on this year with the success I did have, it kind of opened my eyes a little bit and, and let me settle in and realize that, yeah, I, maybe I do belong here. That ball driven deep left field, called well back, looking up, and it is gone! Maybe I am supposed to be as successful as, as the coaches tell me I should be. So it's it's been a pretty good year, and I've been pretty excited how things have been going. Was well, there any one particular moment, one particular game that kind of stands out to you over the last five years? Um, if I had to pick one, I'd probably say Friday night against South Carolina in 12. Um, that was still, and a lot of people still doubted us that year. A lot of people didn't think we were really living up to the hype of what we had done going, I think it was 20-0 at the time. So um, it, was, it was definitely pretty exciting to see Luke at the walk-off on Friday. And the pitch. High fly ball. Deep center field. Back goes Marzilli. He looks up. It's gone! A two-run bomb. the plate and the Wildcats have come all the way back. The South Carolina game was definitely my favorite memory. Uh, we were down 2-1 and we're getting into the ninth and we you know we know we we're gonna win. It's just that, that kind of year. We're undefeated going into that point. It's the first SEC weekend and it was so important for us that year to come out and you know throw first punches and and really show everybody in the country that you know we were going to be making some noise that year in the SEC and you know that's what we came out and do. My, um, my, my roommate Luke Maley hit the walk off home run and so I got to ex experience that with him and you know it was so much fun you know it was a blast it was a memory that I always always remember I'll remember a lot of things about that game and you know it, it, that was my favorite memory.